Okay guys, what's up? I'm Lee Kimby and I haven't done a Mile for 3 video in a pretty long while so I really wanted to do this and I'm gonna talk about this topic right here how I got into YouTube even though I'm not famous I just want to talk about it cause pretty pretty cool story seriously I'm not joking if you think I'm joking I'm gonna kill you no I'm kidding okay so I the very first well okay let's just let, let me start here my very first Call of Duty was Modern Warfare 2 and cause that's when around the time I got a PS3 in like September or August of 2009 everyone was talking about oh Modern Warfare 3 is gonna come out I'm gonna get it and I was like what the hell is Modern Warfare 3 and everyone was like w what are you talking about it's like the best game ever Call of Duty or, or I mean not Modern Warfare 3 Modern Warfare 2 sorry for, sorry about that everyone was like oh Modern Warfare 2 is gonna come, come out I was like what the hell is Modern Warfare 2 and then they were all like, oh, it's this one, like, it's Call of Duty. And I was like, I never heard of it. And oh, right here, there was a transition, transition, or, because post migration, whatever, stuff like that. And yeah. So yeah, everyone was like, what the hell is Call of Duty? I mean, <laughs> I'm getting so mixed up. I was like, what's Call of Duty? And then they were like, the best game ever. It's like so amazing. The, and then I heard that the sto story was like short, like it only took like five hours to beat. And I was like, what the hell is that? I'm not gonna play a game. And then they kept saying, oh no, no, the multiplayer is all. The multiplayer is amazing. And I didn't know, like, about multiplayer. Like, I wasn't. I was all single player because I just came from the PS2. For, well, I just started playing PS2, then went to PS3, so. I was all about single player back then. But now I'm all about multiplayer. Okay, and. I okay so that's my first so then I borrowed the game I never bought the game because I'm dumb I, I just borrowed it for such a long time from like different people because I love that game and I was actually like good at it I did camp a lot because I didn't know how to play and yeah so I was obsessed with that game and then I went on YouTube and typed in Modern Warfare 2 just wanted to watch some things and then I see these like commentators in top 5 plays top 10 plays top 10 of my most amazing I see all the, all these videos I just click on them I just keep watching them for hours like I keep like watching these machinima videos all these like top 10 anage play game plays top whatever and I, I just keep watching everything and like I'm so inspired by their like gameplays I can't even remember who the first who the first person was I, I just like clicked on every related video and kept watching everyone different every different person and I was like wow this is really good and then I come up I come across a white boy 7th Street video uh, uh, I'm gonna post this video in the description because this was a really early video of his pretty early uh, my own for two gameplay on machinima and like it's about like the water boy uh, movie and he does like impressions of it because he sounds like him, or he used to sound like him, and then, I was, okay, this, White Boy was like one of the, uh, like I knew him at an early, like, I watched him, his, that video at like, an early point of when the game, Mario for 2 came out, and I was like, no, actually it wasn't that early, it was like June, or something, and then I was just thinking, oh, this guy, like, when I heard his voice, and I was like, <laughs> I'm so uh, I regret saying this. I was like man this guy is the biggest nerd I was just thinking that I was like what the hell are you saying man I, I looked at the comments I was like what the hell people actually like this guy <laughs> yeah I, I regret all of this I, I, I love white boy he's he's like amazing I love his videos so so like a couple months after that when black ops comes out I start watching his videos I'm, and I'm actually or like no actually before this I, I keep watching Modern Warfare 2 gameplays, and I come across another one of his uh, Modern Warfare 2 videos, I can't remember which one this was, but yeah, I come across another one of that, those videos, and I'm watching, I'm like, oh, this guy again? So, then I watched it, and I was like, yeah, he's pretty good, actually. I actually like his commentaries. And then, I just, like, stopped watching commentaries when Black Ops came out, I was just, like, playing, playing, never watching anybody, and... Yeah, I was just like playing all the time, and then I like people for some reason. Some like my friends at school, my friend at school, 
was like talking about, oh, White Boy's amazing. I was like, oh yeah, I know him. I, I used to watch him. Or I watched like two or, two or three of his videos. I never went on his channel. I used to just keep clicking on machinima related videos. So, oh, here's another host migration. And yeah, it was pretty dumb. Two host migrations. So, okay. So then I started watching like White Boy again. Oh, when Black Ops, in early Black Ops, well not early, like when it came out, well not when it, okay I don't remember, I was just like watching, so then I got, <clears throat> I got into White Boy's channel and I was like, wow, oh, I should subscribe to him, so I subscribed to him when he had like uh, about like 100,000 subscribers, but I knew him before, I knew when he, I knew him when he had like 50,000 or 30,000, I don't even know how much he had, and he wasn't famous, and like I was like, wow, this guy sucks. But no, no. He and then I I watched all his Black Ops Black Ops videos. That's where he got like most popular. I saw. I'm like, oh, these are actually really good videos. And I see more people like, so many people subscribe to him. Like, at like the point of when Black Ops came out to when it ended. So yeah, that's like mainly what I wanted to talk about. And something else I want to talk about. Oh, yeah. I forgot. I got too carried away. It's how I got into YouTube. Sorry about that. Got carried away, guys. So, okay. I'm going to finish the story off by saying, uh, I just, my cousin, he told me about it. I just made some stupid random videos recording TV shows with my laptop, camera. <laughs> and it got 10,000 views, or it has 10,000 views right now. Or like 9,800 and everyone's hating on it on my other channel that was like and then I had another channel because that channel got suspended for copyright music because I like copyrighted like six videos of music so then I made another channel and on this channel I just put like random like gameplays oh 1080 no scope or 1080 quick scopes on black ops I think I re yeah I re-uploaded yeah I re-uploaded that like on this video, my Black Ops Best Moments video, I put that as an annotation, and I, yeah, I re-uploaded that, so if you want to watch it, and it's pretty good, pretty good, like, pretty good, you know, so then, I, I was like, I was like, bored of like, just like, putting in game clips, like, from like, rendering from theater mode, so I was like, man, I'm gonna get a Dazzle, and that's how I came across this account, I was like, as you can see by my like channel information about me, whatever it's called, it says, oh, I'm gonna post my first video December 20th, 2011, and that's like around that time when I got this capture card, and so yeah, now I'm just starting posting Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 videos, and talking about it, and getting some subscribers, so, if you are not a subscriber, you should subscribe, if you watch this, you should. This whole video. So I'm only you can be guys and just showing this last kill cam right here. I'll see you guys later.